and focusing on what I do want in a structured, disciplined way because it doesn't happen naturally. I wouldn't spontaneously focus on what I wanted. I had to teach myself. I'm still teaching myself to do that. But even in this awkward, belabored, artificial way, after this year has gone by, there are multiple relationships that have dropped off. I didn't mean for them to disappear. I didn't mean to end them, but they dropped off when I stuck to my guns and focused on my values and what I wanted. What I would say with these relationships that have spontaneously dropped off in 2022, or well, my experience, they just atrophied and fell away, um, is they were asymmetrical and I wasn't being honest within them. I wasn't being my authentic self. I was fawning and I was overgiving. And then when I stopped doing that, these people were just like, F you, Richard. Like, they got really, really angry. And I was like, oh, okay, well, if you're going to be angry with me for being me, ta Like, professional relationships, personal relationships, they got really, really angry. Professional relationships, they got really, really angry. Personal relationships, they got really, really angry. F you, Richard. And I was like, oh, okay, well, if you're going to be angry with me for being me, if you're going to be angry with me, ta If you're going to be angry with me, ta If you're going to be angry with me, ta-ra. If you're going to be angry with me, ta-ra.